We just got back from a love for hire music video shoot, which is coming soon. But everyone got Chick fil A on the way home, and there's literally like seven people downstairs. And I had just bought this hand sanitizer. And this hand sanitizer is stinky ass hand sanitizer. It literally smells like you sniffed a butt crack and they farted in your face. That's how bad it is. So I'm gonna run downstairs right now and give this to every single person before they eat their Chick fil A. Let's go. Hand sanitizer. Dr. Pepper. Thank you. Oh my god. Jeez, load your Sorry, bro. Sorry, man. Do you not trust us? That's your hair dyes, right? Do you, uh. Such a dick. Smell your hands, brother. What is it? Oh, Got you all. I was wondering how it smells like Right before you eat, it smells like shit. You know what it smells like? Well, it yeah. smell like. Yeah. Oh, ew. You want some more? No. <laughs> Turn this fried. Um, yeah, we're good. Can I some more? That one has like none. What the fuck is this? <laughs> I'm scared. What is it? <laughs> Nothing, brother. What the fuck is it? Hand sanitizer. <laughs> no, it's not. Everybody was like. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? T take away. Is this like fart spray or something? <laughs> <laughs> smell it, brother. Guys, back with the jazz of hands, yeah, in a super happy moods because today we're gonna look at everybody who hates us. So we gotta be in good moods. 2020 has been probably the most hateful and worst in total events ever in my life. Same. I've in never like... had a more wor uh, more horrible year, but it's been bad for everybody. Um, so we want to shed some uh, laughter on the hate that's been going on because we need some positive vibes. So like we said on our main channel video, we just released the Shadow Man full movie. Sam Cole channel we're back, but we did say that was the worst hate we ever got on any video It was so today we're <laughs> gonna take a look at the bad things that they had to say about our Sam Cole channel in light of us coming back for season three Hey, bringing it back to our roots guys. I'm excited to do some positive stuff. I feel like me too. I can't I, it's really hard for me to be happy That's like how bad it is man. It's yeah. like really bad and like all the paranormal stuff We did last year was just very serious. We should just bring some happiness back to yeah Everything. Uh, but with that being said, let's look at some hate. First one. This fucking sucked my dead grandpa's nuts. This fucking sucked, comma. My dead grandpa's nuts. My dead that's grandpa's what nuts. Meant. Yeah, that's what he meant. <laughs> Jesus, dude. Jesus, dude. Stormtrooper. <laughs> okay, this is amazing. This mother his name is Stormtrooper. Bro, I swear you guys always fucking chicken out in every situation. Oh my god, something moved. Let's run away. Boo hoo, go cry about it. Holy shit. All this clickbait bullshit, and you never actually stick around long enough to figure out what's even happening. Oh my god. What? This guy is what? crazy. When have we ever clickbaited, like, on our Sam McCoy channel? Yeah, I feel like everything that we do is describing what actually happens. Like we like our title to a T describes what we do. But I, I liked him because he acted out what we would say. Boo hoo, go yeah, cry about it. Go cry oh about it. Holy shit. And like he's this. also a stormtrooper, so you gotta respect that. I know, man. This video still sucks ass, dudes. Sorry, but I'm done watching your videos. I know it don't matter. I just wanted you to know. Well, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> thank you for telling us. Thank you for letting me know. I appreciate that. There you go. <laughs> you know that he's commented this same exact thing on our last one. <laughs> he but, edited it. So he oh like went back. He like posted and went back and was like, mm, well, let me change something about this. <laughs> Thank you for letting us know though so we can properly say goodbye to you. Peace. <laughs> Actually, you guys are chicks. <laughs> is 100% sure that Paramornormal's <laughs> activities will happen at Hunted Place. Please. You acting at beginning sucks. Nice. I don't even know what to say to that. <laughs> For that... some, I feel like Tashi is like six years old or something. I just love how she called us chicks. Is 100% sure that Paranormal's activities will happen at Hunted Place. What are you saying? I, I can't understand. What are you saying? I don't know why, but I can never take Sam seriously. Something about him. Master Chief said he's fake as f <laughs> 
Master Hello, uh, Chief. Master Chief. I feel Chief. ripped in half, I'm guys. a big fan of Master Chief. And he oh, yeah? Commented. Still? Okay, cool. Oh, well, not anymore. That's that's pretty fake. Something about me. Can't take me seriously. I'm just fake as f Sam is acting kind of weird. He is very mean to his friends. I don't understand this. I don't think I'm his friend. I, I've never thought he was like mean. Am I mean to everybody? No. Like, Corey Jake would say the same thing. Like, I've never ever been like, oh, he's mean. We yell a lot in our videos, and I feel like some people are like, guys, you can't yell at your friends if you're watching Paranormal Activity. <laughs> I think Corey, like, only capitalized your name. Sam! Sam is acting weird. I'll work on that, okay guys? I'll be nicer. Oh yeah, here's Yummy. the best one. Oh my god! How comes Kobe looks cuter than Sam? And the fact that Sam dyed his hair is so ugly! He looks like a hairy ball f***ing sack. <laughs> like what the f***? But Kobe, my baby boy, you look so cute in that pic. You want a date? I'm 16. <laughs> But this is my mom's account, though. Still, I was joking, Sam. You look quite cute as well. I love you both equally. I love you. Yay! Hi, motherfucker! I have a man named Colby. No one steal my man. If you do, I will kill you. Oh, God. Anyway, I love you, babe. I love you, Sam. What, what the, the what the f are you saying? Dude, Dione's comment was like whoop, 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 all over the place. Dione probably typed this out for an hour. <laughs> I love just randomly, she like ends her sentence and goes, Yay! Hi, motherfuckers! <laughs> this is literally so stupid. I saw a shadow. I got deja vu. <laughs> Y'all are literally puppies. What the f? So fucking dramatic. I saw this a lot. Are we dramatic pieces of sh? Oh, yeah. I would. I'm not gonna lie. I think we are, for sure. But like, we're not, like, we're just. Kind of like being ourselves like if you don't like f that or you don't like that don't watch our videos, right? Imagine though like we did the same video and instead of like oh my god I saw a shadow dude. I'm getting so much deja vu in this we were like Yo, dude, I think I saw a shadow. <laughs> it kind of looks familiar as well. Yeah. Could. Like, imagine the entertainment value of that. Like, or come imagine on. if like like all that stuff happened in like the last like episode we had and everybody was just kind of like you guys so there, see that? there was like a tree <laughs> and this thing came on. Like it would not be nearly as entertaining. We gotta be like actually how we like are emotional. Yeah. Your videos will be a lot better once you guys stop acting like children and stop being so goofy all the time. This child behavior like breaking glass on the roof was ignorant <laughs> rolling down the stairs. It was just plain stupid and disrespectful. Stop that and they won't be so irritating to watch. Damn. Damn. I'm sorry Jack. Jack. You just don't like our humor. Jack. We wanted to make videos just for you, man. We wanted you to be happy, Jack. I'm sorry that we, that we weren't. Dude, so I'm sorry you don't think we're funny, man. Stop watching our videos, man. You are the guy that likes to watch the 55 year old men do investigations <laughs> and research projects behind their screen, right? Go watch Ghost Adventures, man. Man, you guys dress like such f boys. I agree. Holy sh**. Look Thank at this you. outfit. Jesus Thank Christ. You, uh, I wonder what strange fashion the next decade will bring. That's kind of like, like he's kind of like saying that we're uh, we're trend setting the next fashion wave, which is kind of dope. Kind of dope actually. <laughs> Thank sick. you. But at the same time, I I agree. I feel like this is very... Uh, Maybe he got it right. Listen, right. I agree with you. <laughs> we can't deny your comment right there. Uh. No offense, but I high key hate this picture of Sam and Colby. They look so awkward and the smile Smiles so fake. It looks like they're being held at gunpoint. LMFAO. It just doesn't look like Sam and Colby. Is it just me? <laughs> look at how awkward we look. I kind of like that picture. I think it looks a little awkward, Pictures. but it definitely doesn't say like it doesn't look like Sam and Colby. My mom said Sam and Colby are disgusting <laughs> <laughs> and a bad influence. So I told my dad that she cheated on him. Oh my god. <laughs> now they're getting a divorce. No. Oh well. Next time she'll <laughs> think twice before dragging Sam and Colby. Be that little rat. I'm gonna ruin my entire oh my family because of this. That's fucking so funny. Damn. I found out later, just FYI, she was kidding. But this okay. is amazing. I hope that That's any funny. mom who's dragging us, you guys play a prank on them too. But speaking of Twitter no. comments and everywhere else and YouTube hate, I know it is hilarious to make fun of us. Whatever. We're putting ourselves out there. We're being ourselves. If you don't like us, fine. That's cool. Uh, we don't give a fuck. <laughs> 
One thing we've noticed is recently there is so much hate between fans and supporters mm -hmm. and like commenters and everything like that. Yeah. And that doesn't make any sense. Yeah, yeah, it's like what I see is it's there's just a lot of people that are like defending me or like defending like people and then there's a lot of people that are doing the complete opposite and then the fans start fighting. It makes no sense. It's like all these people that are supposedly supporting the same person and they have things in common and they're all like on social media trying to have a good time are just like roasting each other yeah. and like attacking each other for no reason at all. Yeah, and if somebody says something mean to you or like, like let's say you voice your opinion, which is too, totally cool to like say whatever you want, obviously. But if somebody's being mean to you, instead of like fighting back with fire, I know it's hard and it's like something you really have to like practice on, honestly, um, all of us is just like block them or don't say anything back or just ignore it. Like fighting fire with fire is only gonna make the fire bigger, you know? I've said this probably three or four times this week. I'm contemplating not like using Twitter anymore just cause it's so toxic. No matter where I go, it's just hate, mm -hmm. negativity. And the, right. the worst part about it is like, it's 2020 guys. There is so much happening in the world. We Why need the we love right now. Need Out of every year we've been alive, this is the year that we need to spread positivity. And I just feel like it's so so bad. Mm -hmm. Someone's bullying you. They're trying to bring you down. Meaning they're like, they're beneath you. Like they are reaching. They're probably not doing very well in their life. They have to attack someone else to feel good about themselves. So mm -hmm. instead of being mad about that, just have pity on them, feel bad for them. Obviously they're in a yeah. bad place. So why even like, you know, like he said, put more fuel to the fire. They're obviously in a bad place and you're in a better place because they're trying to reach for you. So mm -hmm. don't even pay any attention to it. Another thing I really, really, really want to add is I think a lot of people for some reason think that we only notice hate, you know what I mean? Like like people will comment like hurtful things and then I'll be like, what are you doing? Or like in DMs, I've, I've even answered people where I'm just like, why'd you say that? And then they'll be like, oh my God, I didn't know you respond. I love you. Yeah, they're trying to say the most insane thing or hurtful thing just for a notice. And like that, like- We noticed all the positivity too. Yeah, we noticed all the positivity and the, the negative stuff makes us not want to be on Twitter or not want to be looking at our DMs. So please don't do that. Like if we see someone ripping into someone it doesn't make us want to like or you friends. or respond it makes us want to like block that person and like never never even talk to them again so yeah. don't think that's a good thing to do and we can like like we recognize like who does it too and, and sometimes we don't say anything because like i said it just would like make things worse trust me we see a lot like we probably see a lot more than you think and we know like names and usernames of people we know like oh that person's toxic yeah, i don't even want to like ever mean. look at their page yeah now we also know people that are really supportive and be like yo if anything ever happens like we should reach out to these people like yeah. we know that you guys just don't see like what goes on in the like in our personal lives like which is really hard because then people make assumptions and are quick to like judge certain things and like some things that could be taken as a joke or some things that are meant to be a joke like can be taken completely wrong so it makes me feel like i have to constantly be walking on eggshells or oh, else yeah. i'm gonna piss off like hundreds of people doing something yeah, like guys, we're normal people. So you've known us, some of you guys have known us for years. Years. So like, take things we say with a grain of salt. We don't mean to like offend people. We're just trying to have a good time and I really, really, really want you guys to help us have a good time. Yeah. It's 2020 and the best possible thing you can do is if someone's bullying you, don't respond with right. more hate. Not only when you guys are hating on us, it doesn't really matter, like whatever. We can hate on us. We've been doing this for a long time. Leave your stupid hate comments on our YouTube comments. That's fine. Don't hate on each other, because guys, we're a family. Yes. I just feel like yes. we're losing that Sam and Colby family vibe. Something happened. What what happened this past year? Mm -hmm. I don't understand. Because five years ago, like Twitter was awesome. Yeah. And we interacted with everybody and it was like so fun, so positive. Guys. Explore is back, the regular videos, the happiness, no paranormal stuff, no serious stuff. We're gonna get back to like the lighthearted, happy vibes that we were. And all we ask is you guys be there with us. Like yes. we want to bring back our explore family and like actually have a good time. Cause that's what social media is supposed to be. You know, an mm -hmm. escape from reality. It's supposed yeah. to be a good time. We want to be stupid. We want to be like funny. We want to keep making funny TikToks every single day. We don't want to have to worry about like just constantly being judged for like every little thing we do. And for all of you guys that don't cause any problems, thank you yes. so much. You guys are awesome. This is literally for like 1% of people. So for everyone that's just enjoying the content, thank you, continue yes. supporting. We love you. You guys are going to help us make this Sam and Coley family. Yes, and we amazing. see you, trust me, like, 
I, like, I know a lot of people are gonna be like, I've never said anything. Thank you, like we see it. That's amazing. <laughs> 2020 can be still good, trust us. And we're not mad, by the way. Yeah. I wanna say that too, like. It's, it's just, a, it's sad. It's, it's sad. not mad. It's yeah. We're not angry, we're just sad. But, we'll get back. <laughs> yeah, it's not gonna be bad for a little bit. Yeah. All right, guys, well. <laughs> Yeah.